creating a ribbon in Adobe Illustrator CS6. Hello there. In this tutorial, you will learn creating a ribbon in Adobe Illustrator CS6. As you can see, Adobe application is open here. And we have a ribbon here, you can see. And let's see how we can create a ribbon like this, or better. Let's select the rectangle tool from the toolbox. Change the color as you want. Let's create a rectangle shape. Press and hold Alter and with the mouse drag and place it here as it has created a copy. Let's resize it. Now we need to select the color of these two shapes matching the big rectangle here. Perhaps we shall choose a lighter version of the rectangle's color. For your convenience to work, turn the stroke on. Choose and select a color. You can see the outline of the shape has got to your selected color. Now let's reduce the opacity to 50% from here. Let's create another copy pressing Alter button as you know. Now let's bring these two shapes to the sides of the top rectangle. Now we want to make sure that both the shapes sitting on the both sides are aligned. And for that, we will select both the shapes by pressing shift button and click here. So they are both aligned. Now again, having both of them selected, go to object, path, add anchor point. Now you can see the anchor points are visible with what we can change the shape of these objects. Let's select the direct selection tool. Now I'm going to click on this middle anchor point here. By pressing shift I will relocate the point to change the shape of this object like above. The reason I'm holding the shift button is it moves the point proportionally. Now let's do the same with the other one here. Now let's select the pen tool. With the pen tool, I'm going to select the three points here as a triangle shape. The reason we chose to have these shapes opposite 50% is because to be able to do this operation now, see behind the object and to be able to see the points. Now selecting the three points, we are going to fill the triangle with an appropriate color to give it a look of a bend or fold here. Let's do the same on the other side as well. Now let's redo the opacity of these two shapes and make it back 100%. After changing the opacity, we'll select the main rectangle and bring it to the front. Now as you can see, we have a perfect ribbon created here. Obviously, there are many shapes of ribbon can be created as per your choice and demand. As we have given it a outline by turning the stroke on, we don't need it now. So just turn it off now. Now if you want to add some text on the ribbon, just select the type tool and click here. Let's type congratulations.
Resize the text to fit it to the ribbon. Now as we have different objects on this ribbon with different group, let's select all of them and group them together. So they can be treated as one object now. Now as I have said earlier, this can be of many shapes. So let's select the ribbon, go to effect and warp and flag. Now from all these options you can customize and see which combination look great to you. So that is all about creating a ribbon with Adobe Illustrator CS6. Thank you.